Welcome to another edition of Jacqueline of All Trades and today I am tackling skincare yet again and I'm thinking of making a series 30 days of skincare, new year in the skincare you let me know what you think the title should be today we are using La Biot Eternal Ever Bounds and we have the softener the emulsion and the serum. Now, the first thing I did this morning was I washed my face with the ES sensitive, it's a milk, and here's my skin. I'm getting some dry patches and I thought, you know, I need a, a skincare line that actually helps me out. And with this skincare line from La Biot, it's, um, it's using baby leaf complex. And there's broccoli and kale and sunflower and there's one other one um, and so the the idea behind it is that when a plant is brand new and just sprouting out it has the most concentrated active ingredients it has the more the most uh, number of antioxidants to protect the growth and so I'm going to be using this to see if I see any results. Now, some of you might have seen my vitamin C tone-up cream from Etude House. After about four days, I had to discontinue it because it was just, um, it was starting to burn. I think what happened was the, especially now during the, the winter, my skin got too dry and it might have gotten like a few little, uh, just openings, tears, I guess, because of being so dry. And so what I'm gonna give it a try is the same system, but maybe during the summer. Um, I think that for the winter, probably the best bet would be to just have something that is very creamy and gentle and moisturizing. So the first thing that we're going to use is the softener. And the softener for, for the rest of English speaking, um, world is is basically a toner so all I'm just gonna do is I'm gonna put some liquid on it and I'm just gonna very gently put it all over my face and it feels refreshing it has a very very um, it has some fragrance actually um, but you know it feels nice it doesn't feel irritating I used the system last night to see if, um, you know, it would start making a difference. And my face this morning seemed calm. It was still dry in patches, but overall pretty calm. So that was the, the softener. And the next step is the emulsion. And by the way, this system is a brand new, and there aren't a lot of reviews online. So I really didn't get a chance to um, get many um, ideas in terms of, of whether other people like it or not. But um, it feels nice. Here, I'm just gonna show you my hand. And um, just after a little bit, you wanna wait about uh, three to five minutes in between steps. So you, you let each step get absorbed on the skin. And um, it feels a tiny bit tacky, which is actually, I think, a good thing because if you're gonna put makeup on top, then it would help you grab onto the makeup. And the last step that I'm gonna use today is the Eternal Ever Bounce Serum which they call it essence. But for the rest of us, it's a serum. And, and a lot of the times you can tell what is a serum by the size. If it's a lot smaller, it means that it's the most concentrated and that's why you need less of it. So even though you're supposed to put it probably around uh, just a few places, I'm just gonna go all out and put it all over my skin because I'm having some dry patches. I, I had some acne. And uh, I, as I mentioned before, I used some of the retinol. And while it killed the acne, it also just really dried up my skin. So it does have a fragrance, it's faint. 
it does go away it's not incredibly like in your face like something like a Tude House blur primer to me that has a much stronger fragrance and that I don't really enjoy but this um, it goes after just a couple of seconds so it really it really doesn't uh, doesn't bother me so I'm hoping I'm gonna continue using this and I will report on the updates and I hope you're having a great day and we will see you in the next video. Bye!